What's going on everybody? I'm Jory Goodman, the Time Teller. Happy Monday. So what is a sports watch? Well, I feel like for us everyday watch enthusiasts, this is probably something we just know, but we don't really think about it. But I've been getting some questions from kind of beginner watch enthusiasts asking me to define this. What is a sports watch anyway? It's 3.08 p.m. Let's get down to business. Okay, so when I think of a sports watch, I typically think of something with an increased water resistance rating, a robust build, just something that can be easily worn outside of a strictly formal setting. Now, I think a really good example of a sports watch is the Seiko Tuna SBBN 031, a dive watch. Now, I think the most common archetype of a sports watch is some form of diver, again, because they have the increased water resistance rating. They're typically very robust, and you can easily wear them out and about outside of formal Tire. So while my Seiko Tuna may be a very clear example of a sports watch, I think there are a ton of watches that are not so clearly defined that could easily fall into the category of sports watch. For example, the watch I'm wearing on my wrist right now, my Rolex Date 1500. Now this wasn't designed with like a specific purpose in mind, right? It's not a dedicated diver. It's not a field watch. It's not a pilot's watch. It's just nothing but a very good, well-made, versatile piece. And again, the movement, the case, tough as nails, threaded crown with 100 meter water resistance rating, this is going to handle pretty much whatever you throw at it. And especially when it's on the bracelet, it's quite sporty. Next up, my Oris Big Crown Pro Pilot. Now this was designed as a pilot's watch, right? Pro Pilot is the name of the watch, but also it's used often as a field watch. And I think it's quite sporty. You can even find these on a bracelet. I'll find a picture of one right here. And uh, yeah, it's a definite sports watch in my opinion. It's got the threaded crown. It's got a 100 meter water resistance rating. It's tough his nails and uh, yeah it's just it's a sports watch next up my certina ds2 chrono olympic and my seiko 6139 speed timer so why do i have both of these up here well i think a lot of these vintage racing chronographs are definite sports watches but people don't really see them as such and it's a bummer because i think these two in particular have been in some pretty sporty situations i mean the certina ds2 chrono olympic was the watch that climbed mount everest and this seiko 6139 was the first automatic watch in space and I think that's pretty badass and all of this brings me to my next point okay sports isn't restricted to football baseball basketball soccer no 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 no, no. okay I get so many comments from people often probably not watch enthusiasts saying things like sports watches are so dumb because you'd never wear a watch while playing sports Okay, well there are many sportsman activities in which you would wear a watch. Hunting, hiking, fishing, driving, swimming, weightlifting, camping. And there's a plethora of menial kind of everyday tasks in which you definitely want a sports watch over say like a formal dress watch, you know? Everyday chores, yard work, washing your car. My whole point is that you don't have to be playing sports to benefit from a sports watch. So here's what I want you to do, okay? I want you to comment under this video telling me your favorite sports watch and why. Mine as many of you know is probably my Seiko Tuna SBBN 031. I think this is kind of the quintessential sports watch, but uh, let me know what you think. I know a lot of you are probably going to say Vostok Amphibia. And if you're looking for some awesome sports watches and other watches, I have them at the Time Teller shop. So click the link in the description below, shop around. It really does help the channel out a ton. So thank you so much for that. And if you're new here, you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead, click that subscribe button. It takes one second and it helps me out a ton. And while you're at it, you can go ahead and click that little bell icon so you're notified when I upload guys there's so much more awesome content on the way and you don't want to miss out I'm telling you please like comment and subscribe share this with other watch enthusiasts other people that you think would enjoy this I'm Jory Goodman the time teller and always remember I didn't invent time I just tell it